we're just ready to keep giving these opportunities to our students. And that's how the money will be spent. Entry fees, transportation, food. I mean, we need the basics. We love Speech and Bake. Thank you so much. It, it took until the pandemic for me to realize there was no forensics, active forensics team here. Um, and I thought that our students were really missing an opportunity uh, because they are very uh, vibrant and uh, they have opinions and they have, you know, things that they need to share uh, with the public and they weren't being given that opportunity. This year, our school and our community was flooded. Um, we're, we're in Eastern Kentucky and there's just been a lot of devastation. And so um, this help is gonna be really awesome. The biggest obstacle, oh my goodness, the biggest obstacle that this would be able to achieve for us is transportation. I, I kid you not, um, this scholarship will fund travel to two of our local um, state qualifying tournaments that I am super excited that we're now going to be able to attend. These kids work so hard at despite not having access to internet sometimes, despite not even having the educational scaffolding, scaffolding to understand what a congressional debate even is. I'm floored. I'm, I, you just made my day. Are you serious? Serious. Man, oh wow, thank you. So I'm, I'm like, as a debater or a former debater or we're always a debater, you know what it means when you're at a loss of words. <laughs> you know, we were getting to the point where we were saying, we're going to have to limit the numbers. You know, we're only going to bring five kids to a tournament so that we can take a, a van, save on fuel, um, save on lodging, save on food. But now we don't have to tell anyone no. You know, we can, every, every student here at Navajo Prep who wants to participate is going to have that opportunity still. So super, super grateful. I just got off the phone earlier today with the executive director of the National Speech and Debate Association, who was very proud and pleased to announce that the winner of this year's Keith West Memorial Fund is Navajo Preparatory School. Oh, hey, how much did we $5,000. Oh.